is up guys i'm finally making another vlog i have a lot to update you guys i am on the way to the grocery store the baby is right there um actually i'm on my way to the um what is that called the postal service the mail I say post service. So like I said, I have a lot to update you guys on. I think tomorrow I'm uploading finally Sophia's birthday vlog. It's been about a month since I started uploading. I think about two days ago I uploaded a video. So what had happened was lost, um, my aunt, my dad's sister, and it was really hard. It was um, a very long time. A lot of family flew in, from, her family from Texas, Minnesota, like which different place we had a very full house um so uh, she had cancer that she did survive um but she her body was just too weak but and basically the doctor said that there was her, her system was failing and everything so um she was pretty much dying um so everybody flew in to say their goodbyes but although it took about week and a half for her to actually pass um the doctor thought it would happen within like 24 hours but she she was she stuck in there for a while and we had a lot of family here for a long time and then like a week passed and then we had the memorial service so all that took about three weeks so that is why i haven't been uploading i'm sure you guys will understand if you guys have ever lost someone in your family you know it's hard and your mind is everywhere and it's um we had to travel out of town um, we had to travel out of town every single day. We would leave like at 12, 1 in the afternoon. As soon as you know, everybody was changed, ready, breakfast and everything. Uh, and then we would come home like at 1, 2 in the morning. Like it was very exhausting. It was very draining. Um, but it was very good. All the family got together and everybody was, you know, united and everything. And it was nice. Even though under the circumstances it wasn't, you know, good circumstances to come together, but it was a good time that we were together. Um, so now it's been about a week or two since they left, but I've just been trying to get the house back in order and everything. And do you guys know, like, a lot of things have happened this year. I don't know if you guys know this. So in January, we went to Jalisco. We were there for about three weeks. Then we went to Texas right after from Jalisco. We flew to Texas, and that was about another two weeks there like two weeks and a couple days and then from there we flew home and i had about a week and a half to plan sophia's birthday party which i did and then we had her birthday party and then right after her birthday party her birthday was saturday on monday all of this started happening with my aunt um well it had already started happening before she was in a nursing home but she there was like no signs that she was gonna pass away or anything she was just weak and needed to eat more um oh my god where am i going <laughs> I'm just driving around town not even knowing where the hell I'm going this is I can multitask with so many things when it comes to driving so my plan was to go to the post office that's what I was trying to say earlier post office um, I was trying to go I had to go to the post office first I don't have to go there first but I thought it would be easier to go there first and then go to the whole opposite side of town but I guess I'm going to the whole opposite side of town and then the post office also if you guys can't tell I'm blind um, I definitely need to use a full shampoo right now because it is like looking very frosty already. It's only been like about two weeks or so since I have dyed it. Um, well, I didn't dye it. My aunt dyed it. One of my aunts that was here from Minnesota, she's a hairdresser, so she did my hair. Um, I originally wanted to just, just like a balayage and I wanted just to lighten the bottom, but um, she did it all the way to the top. You know what? It was a really nice surprise. I really am digging being basically fully blonde let me know what you guys think <sighs> so like yeah a lot of updates right now i am going to target and i'm going to walmart and like we have so many things to announce right now i think i'm gonna make a different announcement video like so many things are going on right now it's so crazy like so crazy um i'm definitely gonna get some starbucks mommy needs it um, from Target, I think I'm just gonna get like some hangers. Um, what else was I gonna get from here? Oh, some Tupperware. I really like Target's um, up and up Tupperware. So we're gonna get some Tupperware from here and then we're gonna go jump right next to it, which is Walmart, and then I'm gonna get my groceries there. Most of my groceries. So yeah, 
busy, 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 busy day. And then I have to get home and cook. I'm gonna make chicken flautas. They should be delicious, but yeah. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna get a rotisserie chicken from Walmart, make life a little easier on me. Cause it's already like two something. Walmart's gonna be here in a little bit. I'm early shopping, but like it's been, <laughs> we just kind of slept in this morning. And also it's been a kind of hectic morning. I got a Fitbit in the mail under my name with no receipt. I checked my Amazon account. I didn't order it by accident or anything. I'm gonna put this in this one. Um, yeah, it was addressed to my name, addressed to my address. Did you guys send it to me? I don't know. I think it might have been my aunt. I already asked Omar if he got it for me. He said no. Um, <laughs> he said no, he did not buy it for me. And I checked the statements and yeah, it didn't come out of our account. I checked my Amazon account. There was nothing there for the, there's no activity there for the last six months except for the things that I ordered for his dad. Because, um, well, I, I help him order things from Amazon, so there was nothing from there. I think maybe one of my aunts might have sent it to me. We're, we're here. Thanks for letting me know. Um, anyways, we're here. And, uh, yeah, we're here at Target. So I'm just going to go in. But anyways, like I was saying, I'm really bad at talking, guys. My thoughts are everywhere. But I think somebody sent me a Fitbit, and I'm still trying to figure out who it is. I already asked anybody who could possibly order under my name, and they just sent it to my house. Like, who want? Like, I don't ask my brother, my boyfriend's brother, my boyfriend, what the? My husband's brother to see if he ordered it for his girlfriend or for himself or something, and just sent it to the house under my name. But that was not the case. Lucky me, there's a freaking cart right there. My Selena para siempre, H E B, freaking reusable bags. So awesome. Uh, let's put this in so I can put the baby on. There we go. Mama needs some of these again. We got a whole bunch of goodies in here. Sophia is sipping on her Minute Maid apple juice and a little bit of McDonald's fries. I need to get softener. Softener wipes. I mean sheets. Get some sheets. Jay, you want to be in my vlog? Uh, what do you mean? No. Okay. So we're shopping for his girlfriend's, um, what is it? A promposal thingy? All right. I gave him the idea to do an Easter basket with a little egg saying it would be exciting if you would be my prom date. Oh, he's so cute. And then we're also going to do chocolate, co I mean, yeah, chocolate covered strawberries, but they're going to make them look like carrots by dipping them in orange chocolate and then we're getting way too excited over picking candy for the thing also i'm already getting started on picking out sophie's easter goodies i wasn't even pumped to be honest um to get her stuff until i got here and i saw how many different kinds of things and i literally want to fill it up with everything i think i'm gonna get her a huge basket i don't know but look i got these you put it's a magic towel you put it in water and that's what the little towel looks like. I thought it'd be cute since she loves water and she loves bath time. So these would be her little washcloths for now. These are for me and Omar and maybe her basket. And then I got these cute PJs. Oh, it was so cute. Jay thinks I'm weird for talking to myself, but it's for YouTube. Walk away. Is it? Oh, it's really a promposal. He got the ring. There's literally so much candy stuff. I can't wait to do these though. The eggs with the confetti. You get peeps and watermelon socks. Oh. Which one's better? Watermelon socks. It'll last you longer. Hmm? It'll last you longer than peeps. It will. We're gonna get her watermelon peeps. Which I'm actually kind of curious of trying. I really hate peeps, but this one actually sounds interesting. Yeah. I got bags and I don't know why I have that song stuck in my head. I hate Cardi B. <laughs> Are you done? I think so, yeah. Yeah? Oh my god. Wait, we still need to get that little thing to put them in. Are we going to use these? Oh, we still need to get the anchor. Oh yeah, that's that way. Should we do this one? I'm so cute. Promposal. Look at 
We made strawberries. I mean carrots. <laughs> Let me see. We got the promposal in the making. And we still gotta fill the eggs. Let me see. Yeah. <laughs> Hey. Okay. 